Today we will be looking at Fiesta Campesino by Georgi Morel. This is a 20th century oil painting done on canvas in 1959. The name of the painting describes literally what is going on in the picture. Fiesta Campesino translates to rural celebration. Fiesta means celebration and campesino to the native Dominicans means a farmer. Georgi Morel was a Dominican modernist artist who is known for his specialization in costumbrism, or better known in Spanish as costumbrismo. Costumbrism can be best described as the literary or pictorial interpretation of everyday life. It contains attributes of realism and romanticism. From realism, it shows a precise representation of a time and place, and from romanticism, it shows focus on expression and emotion. When looking at the painting, we are immediately drawn to the foreground of the picture. Morel made sure that these three men were the most highlighted and the largest figures to help define depth. The men are positioned in a circle. They are a merengue group, tradition to the Dominican Republic. One with an accordion, another with drums, and lastly, one with a guira. They all have similar attire, button down shirts, casual pants, and shoes. The lead of the band is distinguished by wearing a blazer. I believe these men are highlighted because as they are the main attraction to the painting, they are also the main attraction to the celebration. When we look to the left in the background, you see a group of people dancing with each other. It's a very lively celebration. You see a couple facing each other, but Morel didn't paint their faces, just the silhouette. You see some drinks spilled on the small table. On the right side in the background, there's another group of people seen by a farmhouse. These people are gathered around a pork that is being roasted by two men on an open fire. A roasted pork is a customary celebration delicacy in the Dominican Republic, known to be served at Christmas, weddings, or any other major event. In general, you can see how Morel captured the essence of the rural celebration and what it consisted of, drinking, eating, and dancing to live music. This brought the people together, and he captured that on canvas. This painting was probably meant to uplift the spirits of the Dominican people, because in 1959, they were about to hit the 30-year mark under the rule of dictator Rafael L. Trujillo Molina. He was a vicious ruler who came into power in 1930, he murdered hundreds of innocent people in the form of execution and mass murder. Music would uplift people's spirits, especially in times like this, and especially people who live simple lives like farmers. The musicians would not only entertain them, but also make them feel excited and happy. Merengue is a very lively music. It is a traditional sound of the Dominican Republic. Although he didn't live to see it, Georgi Morel was given the recognition of national artists in the Dominican Republic in 2006 for capturing scenes like this one, the true essence and humility of the country. Maybe to him, practicing costumbrism, he was just capturing what he saw and his daily life around him. But he created a timestamp on how the Dominican people live and brought much pride to their customs. Like in this painting, we see the pride in their music and their custom of celebrations. This is an example of what that celebration would have sounded like. Today we